Sandy Stuvik, our lead driver. He's now a triple supercar GT3 champion. 2019, 2020, skipped a year last year, 2022. Now this title did not come easily. That was some epic race yesterday. Akash started it off. I want to just hit straight into your stint. You tell me about it, because that was absolutely mental. Yeah, first off, I think Akash deserves a very large praise for the job and the gap that he opened up in his stint. Mm. Uh, he opened up a gap enough for me to clear the NSX even without pit penalty. Yeah. So that was fantastically driven by him. Uh, and for my stint, it was just trying to be as consistent as possible and trying to keep the, the NSX behind. Uh, it was difficult, it was difficult, but uh, I think I used all the tools in my bag to try to secure the victory. That looked incredibly tough. Was that one of your toughest ever races? I think it's definitely up there. Uh, it's been a hard fight all year. Mm. I felt we've always kind of been on the back foot in terms of performance. Uh, but otherwise, we, we just kept our head down. Me and Akash, we've worked well, we've gelled well together. Mm. And uh, I know that we have a strong team, and uh, I think the others know that now as well. Yeah. So three titles in Supercar, title back to you after a year away, does it feel good? Yeah, yeah, definitely feels good to be winning again. Uh, the first two weren't enough, so <laughs> this one <laughs> definitely feels very good, uh, but I don't think it's the last one. Right, stay tuned because it's not going to be the last title. I'm pretty sure of that as well. Sandy, congratulations. That was just one of the most epic races in the team's history. Thank you, thank you.